Nursing uh, aides and auxiliaries have a very long history, going back to, in the UK particularly, to the days of Florence Nightingale in the 1850s, where she was the, 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 the mother of the development of the nursing services. And then uh, in the US particularly, uh, the emergence during World War I, uh, where the International Red Cross uh, was the, the supporter and the initiator of a volunteer nursing aids program uh, in, the, uh, in those early years and was then resurrected in the Second World War again in the United States. Our team here at BHB, uh, consisting of our nursing orderlies, our nursing aides, nursing assistants, are a vital part of our healthcare team and they provide quite a bit of support to delivering quality care. They are integral to the team, um, especially our nurses. They assist in quite a bit and spend quite a bit of time with our family and friends and also the patients. Um, it's something that we couldn't do without. We really could not deliver the quality care that we do without this very important group of people. I think at this stage that uh, as we've come through the COVID pandemic, it's the right time uh, to again say thank you to the nursing auxiliaries and aides and orderlies for really the heroic work that they have carried out over the past 12 months. Um, I, I firmly believe that they um, are such an important uh, 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 member of the team uh, and that their work is truly recognized and valued uh, by BHB. And I would want to thank them for all of the great work that they do and continue, have done and continue to do. And I would like to say thank you. Another big thank you. We appreciate you, we value you and for all that you do and the dedication and commitment that you provide for giving quality care at DHB. So happy Nurses Auxiliary Week.